more officers are hired at one Baldwin County Police Department, everyone there is relying on the Sheriff's Office to fill the void. WKRG News 5's Blake Brown is joining us live from Somerdale. The police department is desperate for help, Blake. They are, Cherish. You know, until more officers are hired, they're having to rely on the Baldwin County Sheriff's Office, like you were mentioning a second ago, for that additional help. Now, right now, Somerdale PD is down to five officers. That's a slim number compared to the overall 11 positions that make up this department. Chief Kevin Brock says his department has struggled with recruiting over the last couple of years. It's a problem many law enforcement agencies across our area have dealt with. However, now is the busiest time of year for Somerdale PD, and of course, more visitors are heading south to Alabama beaches for the summer. So until a few more officers are hired, the Baldwin County Sheriff's Office will start taking on additional patrols and responding to calls from midnight to 5 a.m. It's a contract the department and county have entered into over the last couple of weeks. Now the town of Somerdale will reimburse the Sheriff's Office for the extra hours that these deputies will be working. Chief Brock would like to hire at least two to three additional officers before moving forward without the Sheriff's Department's help. But unfortunately, Cherish, he's not sure how long it's going to take to recruit these new officers. But Blake, the chief does have a strategy he's hoping will attract additional officers. He is cherished, so they're, he's hoping to host a career fair here, a job fair within the next couple of weeks. He figures bringing some of those applicants in, some of those people who might be looking for a job into this building to give them a tour, introduce them to some of the staff. He's hoping that will help. You may be watching and wondering how much a position within the department pays. Blake, that depends on experience. It does. So starting off an officer here without any experience can make $20 an hour. Again, that's no experience. But of course, if you do have experience, there is room uh, for for a higher salary. Uh, Chief Brock also tells me later this week he's meeting with some of the town officials and they're actually hoping to bring up that base pay of $20 an hour a little bit higher, too. So that's something we'll continue to follow. We hope they get those needed officers very soon. Blake, thank you so much.